All right, basically, I'll, I'll tell you the quick version. So I'm a scuba diver. I never got certified because I was lazy. So every time I went on vacation, I had to take the resort course. And, uh, and then, you know, then they would sign off and then I could scuba dive for the rest of the week. You know, guided scuba diving with an instructor and, and a whole bunch of yahoos and stupid farmers. All right. So I'm uh, in Turks and Caicos and you have to go really, really far out to the reef. It's probably a good hour boat ride, maybe an hour and a half boat ride. I'm on the boat. There's a Frenchman being a complete asshole, not paying attention to anybody or anyone around him. And uh, the instructor's trying to give last minute instructions before we dive into the water and go down. Honestly, in Turks and Caicos, we went down further than you're supposed to. We, we probably went down 60 or 70 feet. So I scuba dived a bunch and I knew what I was doing. So when it was time to jump uh, overboard, I was one of the first to go. And I got myself all situated on the bottom waiting for everybody else to come down because then the instructor will take us all on a little tour. And as I'm waiting at the bottom, I look up and I see the Frenchman that was being a complete asshole on the boat, not listening to anybody, not caring about anybody, didn't listen to the instructor. So he's coming He's coming down way too fast. He's coming in hot. And I'm like, look at this son of a bitch. And he lands on top of me. And I get so fucking pissed that uh, I, I pushed him. Then he pushed me. And then I punched him. And then he punched me. And then we were trying to fight. But uh, you can't really get uh, any type of footing when you're when you're under the water 50 60 feet in scuba scuba gear so there's uh, the momentum was ridiculous so as you're trying to punch the guy you're like this and your whole body's going Wah! to the side but i definitely got a couple jabs in he got no real jabs in in me and then uh the instructor came down and he kind of broke us up because he just thought we were we were tangled because I think he's thinking to himself, no one's actually going to fist fight under here. That would be ridiculous. And so he kind of separated us. I'm giving this guy a look as we're going on a beautiful dive. And every once in a while, I was able to give him a nice elbow because there was a, uh, a whole bunch of us. So it was a bit crowded. And he happened to be close to me a few more times. I gave him a few good elbows. And uh, long story short, this is the short version, by the way. There's way more to this than, than what I'm telling you here. And then we got back on the boat, and you would think we would have an all-out brawl on the boat, but he went one way and I went the other, so there's no real good ending to the story. I wish I could tell you that as soon as we got to the surface and back on the boat that it was an all-out fist fight, but that would be telling a lie. And that's the basic version of me fighting a Frenchman 50, 60 feet underwater, okay?